Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. So today, I will be showing you how to make this really adorable anniversary cake. So I will be showing you how to stack them up, how to frost them properly, and how to do the drip. So stay tuned! So the first thing I will do is to level the cake. I'm just using a regular cake leveler here. And now I'm adding some simple syrup. Recipe will be down below. This makes sure that the cake is nice and moist. Now I'm just using a piping bag with some buttering and just filling it all in. Now I'm just gonna spread it out evenly before I stack my next layer of cake. Here are my ingredients for my American buttercream. So I will just be creaming my butter and then adding some powdered sugar later on. And then I'm adding some white food coloring for this anniversary cake. I'm using this plastic straw to keep my tall cake in place. And I'm just crumb coating my cake and then I'm going to chill this for 10 minutes until the crumb coat has set. I'm wrapping my flowers with some aluminum foil just to make sure that it's a bit cleaner than just putting the whole thing in. And now I'm putting in the next layer of buttercream. Now this layer of buttercream is a bit thicker than our crumb coating and I will make sure that this is nice and smooth. I'm just doing a final run through of my top making sure everything is nice and smooth. So now these are my ingredients for my ganache drip. I'm just using some Goya chocolate bar and then I'm melting this in the microwave for a while. Then I'm adding some cold all-purpose cream from Alaska and just mixing it until it's all combined. And finally, I'm adding a bit of food coloring here just to make it a bit whiter. Make sure the consistency of your ganache is something like this. Now you can run through the edges and just slowly make a drip on each side. So now I'm just adding in my flowers and just arranging it any way that I think looks nice. Now the most exciting part, I'm just adding the happy anniversary topper to finish off the happy anniversary theme we have here. And I'm just piping some little pink dots here and there to give a little bit of pink accent to our all white cake. So here is our final product guys. So. I made it a really white drip cake with just some pink and gold accents. So I hope you guys can try out this method that I showed you. And please like and subscribe for more videos. See you soon. Bye!